Today we're going to unbox and talk about the Salem Master 69-in-1 Precision Screw Driver. Hey there, NJRoot22.com here with a product review. Today it's the Salem Master 69-in-1 Precision Battery Operated Screwdriver. And when I say preci precision screwdriver, we're talking about a small screwdriver that is used for small things like electronics and so on. And that's the reason we bought it. Because we basically fix our kids' toys here. And I have all these micro screwdrivers that I use. And it's a kind of a pain in the neck. And I said, let me spend 40 bucks on this uh, Salem Master. Whatever that means. Salem Master. I, I don't know. Um, and I'm going to unbox it, but not in the way you normally do, because it's already unboxed. I already have the pieces out and everything. But I want to sh show you something kind of interesting. This is fascinating to me. I think when Apple first came out with their iPhones and iPads, they had uh, the white boxes with a, a nice slick photo of the product on it. Now everybody's doing that. And I believe, I'll cut to the chase here, that somehow unboxing has become part of the experience. Like people love a nice box. This box was impossible to get open. I'm gonna have to use a tool to get it open. I have to like bang it to get get the damn thing. It's in there so hard that you know it's it, I can't even get it out. You have to like use a, a freaking tool to pull this freaking thing out. It's like there's no way to do it. I, I don't think I'm even gonna be able to do it. I'm gonna have to rip the box open. Look at this shit. Like, it's supposed to be nice. Anyway, you open up this screwdriver. Here it comes now, finally. There's no way to get a grip on it. I'm going to rip the fucking thing open. I'm going to return it, too. Because it's ridiculous. So this box is supposed to be like an apple, where it has like a sleeve, right? And inside the box is more boxes. It's like, it's like an Easter egg hunt. It's ridiculous. I swear to God, this is so freaking annoying. I, I can't get it out of the box. There's no way to grip it. It didn't slide out, and I'm, maybe I won't return it. But anyway, this stupid freaking box, it's, I'm going to get a paper cut. It's like, this is really fucking annoying. You can't open the box. Anyway, inside the box was like nine more boxes, okay? The people love unboxing. It's so stupid, all right? Here's the box. There's another box, and they have these, these, these nice boxes, right? And there's more boxes inside the boxes. It's like people, it makes people feel good about spending money on things. Oh, look at this. There's four more boxes in here. All the, these are the screwdriver bits, by the way. There's the power screwdriver. And like, this is the power screwdriver here. It's a little LED lit thing. And you, you take, take the bits out. And this is a nice screwdriver, I have to say. It, it's, it's good. Um, and inside here is a little, another box. There's like 50 boxes inside this freaking thing. And I think it's stupid that people, they have to put these things in these crazy boxes to make people feel like they got something. I think it's a psychological trick. It really is. So here's your base. This is the base for the, uh, this is the base. You go like this, you stick your little pen in and it sits on the desk or wherever and you can just stick your screwdriver in there like that and there's a magnetic uh, magnetic pad which will probably erase your phone but this is where you can put all your parts this is a magnetic pad that comes with it so you don't lose your screws that's kind of nice just don't put it near any mag uh, what do you call it device so there was like seven boxes inside the box and, and you have to keep opening up there's a USB cable that comes with it there's some sort of magnetize. You can magnetize and demagnetize things with something here. And there's all sorts of like little chips to pry your parts open. There's a suction cup for some, yeah, for pulling off a screen. And there's a little vial here. If you get caught with this in your car, the cops will think you're up to no good. But this is just little screws for circuit boards and so on. And it comes with, you know, it's nice that they put 
You know how Amazon has uh, frustrate, frustration free packaging? They should have done that with this too, because it would probably have been $10 less if they didn't put all these little boxes in. And another thing that this, this comes with three vials. It looks like lab vials. I take it to the lab. Um, these are where all the bits were. And I thought this was going to be a real pain in the neck, but it's actually quite useful. You, uh, you have this sheath here, this tube. Oops, wrong side. You have this tube here and it's connected to a rail and you pull your, your uh, bits out and you take your bit and you put it back in. It, it's, it's functional, but it's, it's not efficient. I would rather have a, a tray. I lost audio again because I was uh, greedy and I didn't want to check my uh, batteries in my wireless mic. So I went on and on about how um, the... Uh, case that came with it was kind of like odd because it had only two slots for the uh, equipment like basically one for the screwdriver and one for one set of bits like you had no way to bring all your bits it was like a really dumb uh, thing they should have given you a case that had four slots in it I don't know but I, I really do think this uh, this screwdriver is pretty damn good um, and I think the, the torque problem is, is probably well thought out because uh, if you have too much torque on, a, on an electronic device, you can end up breaking it. So I, I recommend these, these type of things, and that's it. So please subscribe, click the like button, and that's it.